the, the right, honorable Prime Minister, I don't, yeah. <clears throat> the family of Honorable Simeon Nyachai, the Honorable Federal Excellence Governors, uh, Cabinet Secretaries, members of uh, the Senators with us here, members of Parliament, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Council of Governors, I wish to first and foremost convey my heartfelt condolences to the family of Honorable Simeon Yachai and the Bagusi community, as well as the people of Kenya at lunch for the loss of a great Kenyan patriot. Even as we mourn the loss of the late Mze Nyachai, let us celebrate him for his distinguished public service which contributed to Kenya's economic growth. I have personal vivid memories of Honorable Simeon Nyachai as a very committed and towering provincial commissioner whom I used to admire while I was a young provincial administrator. I knew him as a very competent and tough public administrator. However, even as tough as he was, he had a lot of compassion and, and also patience with the young officers in the service. I only remember one occasion uh, when we had a meeting on district focus for rural development, and he was the chair, and we were young DOs and DCs. And I, I, the others urged me to ask him a question why those of us whom he had sponsored to America and the US, about 50 of us, when we came back with masters and postgraduate diplomas, why we could not be promoted. He just laughed at me and told me, young man, it's not the degree which can make you be promoted, but I hope your degree will make you efficient and work well so that you get promoted. As a result of his excellent performance as a PC, Honorable Simeon Echai was promoted in quick succession to higher positions of permanent secretary in charge of district focus for rural development. And thereafter, he was soon promoted to the then most powerful position in the civil service, the post of chief secretary. After Honorable Simeon Echai retired from the civil service, he became a member of parliament for Nyaribari Chache constituency. He later served as, a, as cabinet minister in various uh, uh, ministries. The legacy of Honorable Simeon Yachai will be remembered for many years for his contribution in the various sectors such as the public service, district focus for road development, and also in the various ministries, agriculture, community affairs, water, roads, energy, and finance. As I conclude, Mzee's rich legacy will remain embedded in the history of Kenyan nation for his distinguished contribution to the country's economic growth. His legacy will also be projected by those he mentored. And some of those he mentored are with us here, such as Waziri, Dr. Friend Matiangi, and many others. They will progress his legacy, including uh, his dear son, Charles Nyachai, and many others. May the Lord God comfort the family of Honorable Simeon Yachai, and may the Lord God also rest his soul in eternal peace. Asanteni. <clears throat> Thank you. May I now take this opportunity to introduce the governors who are with us so that they can wave to the, the, one, uh, to the, to the congregation, starting with Governor James Ongwai, who is actually the late Nyachai's governor. 
Asante sana, Governor. Then we have Charles, I mean Nyandarwa Governor, Honorable Kimemia, who is also the Chairman of the Central Region Economic Block. Is there any other Governor around? Okay. Then, of course, we have the, 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 Deputy, the Deputy Governor Kisi, Joas Mangi. Kuna wengine? That's it. Asante sana. May God bless you. Asante.